tagged me in it and I saw it at first and then I hadn't have time because I was I was busy and then I checked it again and I'm like, oh, Jessica Jones. And then I looked and then it said who was... What? What is good, guys? Howdy ho. Uh, uh, that sounded weird. Yeah, that did. <laughs> what's good, the, what's good, my pack? My Vernon Kid here back again. Uh, how's everybody doing on there? I hope my fellow comic geeks are really cool and having a good time. Uh, there were some good comics that came out this week. And next week, the JLA... Avengers crossover special edition comes out in local comic shops. Please try to support, try to get to help and support in honor of Mr. George Perez. That 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 means so much to me if we can we can help him and help just in need because unfortunately, you know, it's it's not going to be He's living out his life, but it's just in the back of my mind for me, for surely, it's just the fact that I know he's not going to be here. And there was a guy I never got to meet, and I always wanted to meet him because he was one of my all time greats. But trying to stay positive with this. So let's try to stay positive. So welcome back to Geek Thought, guys, as always. And today on Geek Thoughts, if you looked at the title, yeah. My friend, uh, Gail Simone, is returning back to Marvel. And the last time we saw Gail with Marvel, she did a, a very good job with Domino. She gave Domino more character, more character development. Domino just wasn't a sex-crazed sex addict mutant who has probability luck powers and that was some of the things that and i love domino but it was just like give me more than just oh she's on a mission and next thing you know she's she she's you know she and okay time to time to screw you know <laughs> anyway but gail is returning and this was actually this was actually um notified to me not by gail herself or any other means first it was actually i was actually tagged in a post on facebook by my friend mr multi he tagged me in it and i saw it at first and then i hadn't have time because i was i was busy and then i checked it again and i'm like oh jessica jones and then i looked and then it said who was what so, Gail is writing Jessica Jones. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I did a video a long time ago, not too long ago, where I talked about characters, Marvel characters I think Gail would be good at writing. And I believe, I got to go back, but I believe Jessica Jones was on that list. But the fact is, the series is called <clears throat> Variant, and... <clears throat> Gail is writing it, along with artwork by Phil Noto. Um, I like his art very good. Uh, very, very Asian-like. It's 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 very uh, Eastern, like age, far Eastern artwork that works. Um, uh, he's done artwork for Black Widow, Elektra, things like that. Now Jessica Jones. So, but I'm really happy for Gail because I miss Gail. I miss you know, reading her work. And not too long ago, I think last week, they uh, there was a comics comic that came out that Gail did write. Um, uh, I, I don't know where I put it, but I have it and I posted it to her, but I haven't read it, read it yet, but I'm definitely going to. But yeah, this is really interesting to see. It's called Variant. And 
the concept, I want to make sure I get the, the whole concept so I don't, I don't ruin it. But it seems like it's a multiverse, like a multi-title. Uh, it's five five part miniseries, which I'm really liking that Marvel is doing this stuff now. They're 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 not just going into an ongoing series. You know, they're they're doing they're letting writers do like a mini or a max because that works. But uh it it was uh I I checked on the, the Marvel.com post to read it from there, but they say it was actually first uh it was it was first announced by comicbook.com okay but basically here it is it's called Jessica Jones meets Jessica Jones uh as announced on comicbook.com the fan fa fan favorite private investigator will find herself on a multiversal adventure in the variants a five issue limited series by legendary creator legendary creator Gail Simone, and artwork by Phil Noto. Uh, after taking on what seemed to be a routine case, she will come face to face with several versions of herself, which will lead her to question everything she thought she knew about her life and her choices. Now, this is really interesting first, right? Let me let me stop right there because that's, that's also really interesting because... You know, we're, we're seeing a lot of this as of late in different comics books like Dynamite is doing uh, Dynamite just did something called uh, the Sonya verse where we see different versions of Red Sonya, Red Sonya, Blue Sonya, uh, Gold Sonya. They just put out a, a book that I'm reading right now called Hell Sonya, where she's a demon um, and each these different Sonyas have different occupations like you got Red Sonya you know, the barbarian, the she-devil, and then you got Blue Sonia, who is a U.S. Marine sniper, I believe, or something like that, or Navy SEAL, but she's really cool, and we're seeing this now, so to see Jessica Jones, and if you look at the, 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 the photo of it, you could see her, basically, three of Jessica's uh variants now two of them she actually was and one is interesting so as you can see right there you see her jewel look her her classic look when she first started she was with jewel she was named jewel and i'm not talking about the singer she was jewel before she met purple man and then in front she's wearing the domino mask that's her nitrous uh look that she had later and she, but she was really under control but then you can see in the back but to after uh jewel you can see that it, she looks like it looks like a shield uh a shield outfit now i'm not i'm gonna be i'm gonna be honest with you guys i can't be the only one the only comic geek that misses shield i do miss shield being in the comics not just in the comics, but I do miss the, I miss it. I miss it in the MCU. It, it it really sucks that that organization is gone, but Sword is still around. Why not bring S.H.I.E.L.D. back? And then, of course, you got the classic look. Now, Jessica Jones is everything that they say. She's tough as nails. She's 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 a private investigator. Uh, she's a mother and she's a wife. So she's a triple threat. And I love that about her. And to see that Gail was writing that, that just, <laughs> this puts a smile on my face. So this is what Gail had to say about it. She said, um, she said, first, let me, let me get this out. When Tom Bervort, uh, I uh, believe I'm saying the name right, uh, offered me the project i went and reread all the jessica jones stories from the classic groundbreaking michael bendis stories to the more recent and fantastical good kelly thompson i do like kelly thompson good stuff uh stories that you definitely should read yes you should they are really good um and they're just exciting compelling reads there isn't another there isn't another comic character like her that was 
immensely exciting. But even part of part from that, it it's been it's being drawn by the impossibly brilliant Phil Noto, a bucket list artist for me. Cool. Uh, even the covers are mind bending. So this is a joy from start to finish. Incredible. Hope people love it. Well, Gail, I'm going to let you know right now. Um, my pack knows me to be a, my pack knows me to be a very big and keen fanboy of yours. And I'm a loyalist and yeah, they know I'm, I'm going to support you. I actually tweeted you, tweeted her right after I was like, yeah, I'm, you know, I'm going to support you. Love you. That's it. Um, I love that Gail has read and, and, and that's not BS and right there. Because there are times you have a lot of writers that say, yeah, well, I read all of, and sometimes it makes you wonder, are they bull, BB, you know, are they BB and us, uh, BS and us, or, or did they really do it? Gail, I know for a fact, probably has done that, has read the Bendish run and Kelly Thompson run. Um, but to see Gail come back to, to write this, this is going to be interesting to see Jessica meet another version of herself or a younger version of herself or something like that. I'm I'm wondering how the conversation go. Like when she sees Jules, she's going to be like, well, what was I thinking? You know, <laughs> stuff like that. Or, you know, or when she sees uh, Nitrous, you know, she's like, oh, it wasn't bad, you know, I, I, but I was basically under control or, you know, di whatever versions of her is going to come around. It makes me wonder. And what's the whole purpose of the story is, but I cannot wait to read this. It comes out, I think it comes out in June. So a five part limited series. I'm on board. What say you guys? Are you on board? To all my comic geeks out there, it's good to see a title coming that's gonna say Gail Simone. Gail Simone. I'm sorry. I'm coming off like a schoolboy and a fanboy, but yes. Count me in. I'm signed on. Gail, you know, if you are watching this, you know you have my support, my friend. I will definitely be picking this up, as always. But this is really good. Gail Simone writing a Jessica Jones story with multi-versions of Jessica Jones. What say you, my pack? And with that being said, thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Please don't forget to uh, like and uh, please give it a thumbs up if you like. Um, don't forget, guys, I have merch in my merchandise store uh, down below. If there's something you like, please check it out. You might like it. I am working on some new merch as well. And more importantly, guys, don't forget, I have the Patreon. The Patreon is going strong. I just got a new Patreon um this week um sean allen comic freak x dude if you're listening thank you for joining you became a i think you you're a beta level uh tier member meaning basically you you have all the previous tiers but you're the biggest exclusive tier for that is uh i it's a exclusive 50 question Q and A. So basically guys, I got Sean Allen can ask me 50 questions. and I got to answer them. So uh, that's going to be fun. I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing what these questions are, but I appreciate it. So now I am up to yeah five, five Patreon members. I appreciate the five I have. I look forward to, uh, continuing and growing but in the meantime this is still about gail so you guys tell me what you're thinking about what you're thinking what you're thinking do you like it do you hate it if you're not jessica jones fans you know i can understand but if you are gail simone fans and you know what you're getting into when you pick up a book with that woman's name on it 
Tell me. What say you? And with that being said, my pack. This is Mom, Friend, and Kid saying peace, one love. Stay tuned. Keep it real as always, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Deuces.